Acting fire captains Nicole McKinney and Jessica Jackson held out by St. Louis Tuesday as proud examples of women representing St. Louis. They're captains what? in name only. They are being okay, denied girl. the pay that comes with that captain title because of a St. Louis department. You know sisters know how to work that pole. Good fuck out of here. Um, she she slid down <laughs> like a champ. <laughs> sisters, they, they know how to work that pole, man. Shit, man. I'm surprised you didn't hit the sleep. Shout out to all the girls of Sensationals, man. <laughs> Jackson, held out by St. Louis Tuesday as proud examples of women representing St. Louis. They're captains in name only. They are being denied the pay that comes with that captain title because of a St. Louis Department of Public Safety decision, a decision St. Louis aldermen apparently oppose unanimously. 100% agreed. Alderman Joe Vaccaro is head of the Public Safety Committee. He says he was disgusted to see the city taking credit for diversity that he doesn't think we're really upholding. I think it was somewhat disgraceful on the city's part because you're putting a bunch of people out there saying, look how great we are. Two of them are African-American women that have been on the promotion list and have not been promoted yet. They're acting captains doing the job, not getting paid for the job. About 17 firefighters impacted and growing. About a dozen of them stood behind Captain Robert Dan Eveland in an October public safety Zoom meeting where they confronted the public safety department. Out of the 700 plus suppression members of the St. Louis Fire Department, there is incredibly only one female supervisor at this time. The city can triple this number just by approving these promotions. And he said the held up promotions also include four out. Um, not for nothing, man. If there's a fire, I don't give a fuck who if the, the, the gender of the captain. And I prefer to be a man, man. Yeah. Like, come on, man. We're talking about fucking fires and shit. Have you ever seen a, um, a fire a team um, string their, their whole fucking hose down a long ass alley? Pause. I, <laughs> I saw it one time. I said on the back porch it was a fire across the street on the other side of the street and i sat there and i watched them do their job they had to fucking had to get that hose all the way down a full block alley and then they had to break out the windows get in the house the house was on fire that is some strenuous laborious work have you ever seen the one of the female firefighter that it, it, it's it's a it's a door that they're supposed to knock down by running into and it's it, it's counterweighted so you have to hit it with a certain amount of force in order to like break through mm -hmm. and the female like hit it like four or five times couldn't do it male hit it one time broke through it's like i don't want a female coming to try to get me because oh <laughs> is she going to be able to carry a full-grown male out probably yeah, not exactly exactly yeah like this is not something where like diversity is a big thing. I don't give a fuck if it's a black. I wouldn't give a fuck of no black people. Just put the best person. If the best person is black, put them on there. But, but she's doing captain work and not getting paid for it. I get it. And here's the thing, though. I get she's doing captain work. But, they, but, but okay, fine. Then fuck it. Give her the job. But all I'm saying is I'm not it, it's not a it doesn't bother me that there ain't a bunch of women running the fucking fire department. Do you I'm notice not, they said oh, 17 no. you notice I said 17 others there? And if you look yeah. in the back, it's all the other ones. They're like using them in order to try to push through the exactly. promotions. Exactly. They're using they're using the black ones. They said, look, we got some black women and 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 to, so push these 17 promotions through <laughs> so we can get these you know yeah they're definitely using black and they're smart but yeah, did they even yeah, explain they did they even explain why she's not getting paid like they didn't even explain the rule yeah that's preventing that it's like well what the fuck is the rule this is why i hate the news she probably doesn't probably didn't have a whole lot of leadership experience <laughs> that's why you hate the well, what the it's news. probably also a hiring freeze because they don't have any money. 
It's, it's too much, man. Listen, man. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Um, let's, uh, let's, why are you laughing? You're a fool, man. Yeah, they're acting captains, doing the job, not getting paid for the job. About 17 firefighters impacted and growing. About a dozen of them stood behind Captain Robert Dan Eveland in an October public safety Zoom meeting where they confronted the public safety department. Out of the 700 plus suppression members of the St. Louis Fire Department, there is incredibly only one female supervisor at this time. The city can triple this number just by approving these promotions. And he said the held up promotions also include four African-Americans. My first statement is this is just a damn shame. We have to remedy this. Former DPS director Dan Isom held his ground in that meeting, in part claiming the need to streamline what he called a top heavy fire department. We need to figure out ways to shift more resources to the EMS um, paramedic side, which is the overwhelming majority of calls that we're receiving. The battle complicated by a federal right, lawsuit crime. over firefighter testing and disputes over promotional exams from 2013. That resulted in a 2017 settlement agreement that says in part, the city will not intentionally delay promotions from the current lists in anticipation of new lists being certified. We reached out to the Department of Public Safety for their latest response. Spokesperson Monty Chambers answered, quote, we are unable to comment due to pending litigation. Vaccaro maintains the holdup needs to stop. Do the right thing. Promote these people that have been on that list, and we should be back paying them. For the Fox Files, I'm Chris Hayes. You know, it's it's, you pay for it and all of, of course it's effing top heavy, because these guys are using the fire department to get pensions. <laughs> you know, and I say to those chiefs, yeah, you, you, you want your pension? Break down this fucking door. It's on the other side. <laughs> or carry this fucking dummy that's the weight of a human. Get your fucking pension. Get your promotion. What the 